Hello everyone, this is Serge from GhostRoomNoob.com and I'm going to show you how to scan and import your face into NBA 2K17. Uh, scanning is done by using the My NBA 2K17 app on your smartphone. Uh, once you install it from the App Store, make sure you link up to your PlayStation or Xbox account by logging into it through the app itself. Uh, once you've done that, on the home screen of the app, choose the NBA 2K17 by sliding the basketball to the left and click on the scan your face button. This will begin the scanning process. Scanning your face is not as straightforward as you might think. The app gives you tips on how to do it, but there are a lot of problems you can encounter. That's the reason why we made this video to help you through the process. The first problem we have was that by using an older phone, HTC M7 in this case, the app distorted the image from the camera for unknown reasons. Using the latest gen phone, we did not have that problem, but the app decided to act funny and say it doesn't recognize our face. I just close the app and restart it and face recognition should start working in it afterwards. You might also wonder whether to use the front or the back camera. The front camera has lower resolution and it's hard to hold the phone by yourself and turn your face around without making a mistake at the same time. So however, the first success we had with the face scan app was when we used the front camera. If you decide to have a friend help you and use the high resolution back camera, I recommend you have that friend move the phone real close to your face. Uh, back cameras take wider angle shots and that can confuse the face scanning app in the game. Just have someone to scan your face while standing real close. Even when you do everything right, the app can be fidgety and your scans can fail and you have to repeat them several times. Just soldier on through it. You should be fine in the end. I have one more tip for you. When you get to review the pictures that you have, make sure none of them have you with your eyes closed or have your head tilted in a certain way or a natural way or something that you think will mess up the final scan and import into the game. Trust me on this one, just repeat your scan and do it all over again. Even when you have a good scan on the phone, importing that scan into the game on your console can fail. I had the game tell me that the face scan is not good or it would get stuck at some point, never ending the face scan import. You need to know that the face scan import does take a lot, like 5 minutes or so. But if you have been waiting for 10 minutes or more, the game is probably stuck and you need to close and restart it and provide a new face scan from your phone app or it's just gonna get stuck each time you try to re-import the same face scan. Remember how I told you that you need to upload a perfect scan? Well, I had an average one here and look at what I got, so please make sure that your recording and scanning is done properly. Now, if you had good lighting, good phone camera, good background, didn't make faces while being scanned or close your eyes and the software upload went well and the import didn't get stuck, you will get a custom player face in NBA 2K17 that really resembles you and you can have a great time building a career with a dude looking just like you. With a few final adjustments in the game's interface as seen in the video here. I hope these tips help you create your custom character in the game. And one more thing, we tried scanning this guy several times, but no matter what we tried, the face scanning app refused to recognize his face. I wonder why, that's pretty rude too. I hope you liked this video and that you like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This is the new signing out. Nice move and finish. I think the halftime break really gave him a second move. It looks like it may have had the opposite effect on the defenders. I mean, right there, it looked like they were still in halftime mode. And so here's Michigan.